Well, we are about two months away from opening day at Winter Park Resort. The ski area, though, is already buzzing with a lot of activity. Crews are working around the clock to beat the clock and finish up construction around this resort. Matt Croshall live at Winter Park for us tonight. And Matt, skiers are certainly going to notice some big changes up there. And Karen, there is a lot of activity everywhere you look out here. One of the biggest projects and most expensive, though, a new gondola. But even the iconic logo out here at Winter Park is getting a facelift. Before the mountain opens to an army of skiers and snowboarders, armies of construction workers chip away at a long list of projects. There's going to be that sort of splash of cold water to the face that, that says, OK, you know, things are changing a lot here. Um, and it really is a kind of a new era. For Winter Park, New management and the new Altera company means more major cash flowing in for capital improvements. September is a huge month construction wise for us. A brand new logo and a brand new mission, bridging the local community and the resort. With our new brand that we're doing in conjunction with the town of Winter Park, there's a lot more integration, not just with the resort, but really between the resort and the entire community. And so it's about bringing all of those different entities together. As this little resort expands. Got over $30 million in capital investments going in this summer for next winter, all of which will be ready. Our new gondola, our new plaza project, our new snowmaking. Projects they're confident will be completed in time for the winter season. It's fast approaching. Name your favorite resort, and I can tell you they have some type of major project going on this summer. There's new lifts going in at Loveland and Copper Mountain, as well as Arapaho Basin. So a lot of money going into making the experience better for folks up here in the high country. We're live at Winter Park. Matt Kroschel covering Colorado First. Wow, we can't wait, Matt. Thank you.